Hello guys, it's the Exploding Creeper here. I just quickly want to show you my little secret base entrance design using redstone and sticky pistons. Sorry about the sticky pistons, I know they are hard to acquire, but believe me, it's well worth it used. So, as you can see, we have a little hallway here, which is our entrance. But you might just be thinking, what the heck is going on here, tech? In other words, the Exploding Creeper. <laughs> So you might be wondering, what the heck is going on? Why can't, what's going on here? I, I can't even, there's no entrance. And then you'd start breaking blocks and find my base. But, there's one exception. See, this, this is a button. And it's hidden. Hidden, not hidden. Behind the stone texture. So, if I were to press it, this is not the entrance I was in just now, what just happened? Well, let me explain it to you by showing you a smaller demonstration of it. This is a failed one. <laughs> uh, I'm sad. I'm not sure if this is the better one either. Basically, <laughs> um, I can basically break it down and stuff, so yeah, I'll do that. First of all, Let's explain the mechanics behind it. And leave you with the bare structure. So what you have going on is you can actually stand here and the pistons won't push you. Uh, so if you just want to have people fall into like some sort of trap in the end of a hallway and just run and stuff, that's also good to use for this. Put some lava at the bottom. So once you press that button, it goes into a delay then this activates these pistons which push, push you into a suffocation wall but that's not what we're gonna do what we're gonna do is have these guys which power the bottom pistons like this is a bottom piston right here see that it's extended so if I were to remove this block it would not be extended place it back would be extended the reason that works is because this block, um, torch powers block, block powers piston, piston extends stone. Simple enough. Okie dokie. So let's continue on. Now after you push your button, power's gonna come through. And first of all, it's gonna make the floor collapse on you. If you notice that, that happens first. And then this pushes you. And this has a one tick delay two tick I assume it's called because by default repeaters that's one delay two delay three delay four delay as I recall so this is a two delay tick and then this is a one delay tick so what, what goes on here is this gets powered after you fall through slightly so it helps keep it kinda secretive heck you don't even need this thing to be honest you really do not need this thing watch if you want to have some sort of lame design you can always pitfall not not too hard to do really so I'll just quickly show you how to build my design though uh, be aware that this will not work with only one three sticky pistons is what it requires if you were to oh I destroyed that See, I tried the design with one, but it wouldn't work because it would push me either that way or that way because I didn't. It wouldn't w let me suffocate. But a design with only three, which by three I mean nine, will work perfectly. So let's just build this real quick. You want to dig a ditch? like that. This is just where you're going to fall in after you use it. So you put your pistons like this and you want to build another hole um, a bit out more. Place stone dig down place torches place blocks 
See, now it's covered up. Now what we want to do... My bad. What you want to do is dig down. Like that. And so that the, these are exposed. Put repeaters. That's that part. Okie dokie. So, I'm just going to hide this real quick. Put a door. For looks. And now... Now, just be aware, you can do this on both sides. It's just going to be more time consuming and take up more pistons. So now you're going to build uh, a little place where you can stand, just in case if this is going to be a trap. Or you want to use it as a trap. So that part is complete, and we want to have our output coming out through here. This is where we receive power. I already placed the button, my bad. So now place blocks on top of these pistons and next to these make a stairway coming down apply wire place a repeater make it like that redstone and then do what I just did so now I'm just gonna put a bit of delay on this. Boom, 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 and you're done. Now let's test it. Oh, I need to go home. Secret, secret base time. Okie dokie. Now just remember, you do whatever the heck you want down here. Heck, you can make it like fall really far down into some water. That's a great that'd be a great idea. Well, that's enough for me. Thank you guys for watching. I have been the exploding creeper. And before I go, I really want to show you guys something. <laughs> I got bored, so I made what I like to call a transmutation circle. So you wanna sacrifice uh, sacrifice about nine pieces of redstone first. You put do the outer layers. That's not right. Then you do the inner one, and then... No, I'm joking. I uh, put a clock down there. You can always just go down here. It's not very complicated redstone, actually. I'm just turning it off, though. It'll, it'll lag my game. Well, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate views, subscribers, all that stuff. Share me with your friends. Who knows? Maybe they they like they'll admire the poop out of me. No, that that's a joke. Please don't have them admiring my poop. Okay, we'll talk to you guys later. I gotta catch some seeds. What the heck? Goodbye.